Rescue crews returned to Rockaway Beach today looking to find the two teens that disappeared in the water yesterday. Meanwhile, the beach was packed with people trying to take advantage of the unusually warm temperatures. Nate Rogers tells us why beachgoers were quite disappointed. Bill, it was the perfect day to be at the beach and enjoy the water, but if you were caught swimming, you could face a steep fine. New York City Park security quite busy Wednesday working to keep folks out of the water. New York City beaches are officially closed after Labor Day, which means no lifeguard on duty. It's unfortunate. I feel like if the weather is over 85 degrees, you should be able to go in the water. <laughs> yeah, it's a bummer, but I guess they look for safety. Safety comes first, so just got to deal with it. You know? At least we get to go to the beach today. Aside from the surfers, if you got in the water, you'd possibly be fined up to $225. Those not willing to take the risk either sunbathe, built a unique sandcastle, or, looky here, grabbed a friend and came up with some creative dance moves. Away. Yeah, of course. It's 90 degrees and I'm hot and I would like to go into the water, but I'm okay. If we can't go in the water, we can't go in the water, but at least wet our feet. Throughout the day, emergency units, including FDNY personnel, dive teams, and helicopters canvassed the area looking for two swimmers who went missing here yesterday. I got a sense from just how deep I went, which wasn't very deep, okay. that the, the pull to get into the water is really strong. Mm -hmm. And so the waves are a bit strong coming in, but then they also pull you out into the water pretty strongly, even if you're just kind of standing at the shore still. So I, I kind of understand why they're being really cautious. And finally, Bill, as the day progressed and beach currents intensified, especially because of those missing swimmers, beachgoers started to take a little bit more heed to what officials were saying to stay out of the water or swim at your own risk. In Rockaway, Queens, I'm Nate Rogers for Chasing News.